Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Keith and welcome to my review of the new film, Gifted. The new film that stars Captain America himself, Chris Evans, Academy Award winner Octavia Spencer, and upstart extraordinaire McKenna Grace. Now when I saw the trailer for this film, I thought to myself, oh great, here we go, another custody movie. I mean, we've seen so many of them over time, haven't we? And I thought to myself, well, here comes another one. In this film, Chris Evans plays uh, the uncle to McKenna Grace's character. Now he's raising her and he's raising her perhaps not in the best of circumstances in terms of location, but raising her with a lot of love. When all of a sudden it's discovered that she shouldn't be in grade school, she should be in university because she's a genius. Yes, they discover that she's a prodigy and they want to uproot her and put her in a, in a gifted school. The only problem is his sister wouldn't have wanted that for, 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 for the girl, so Chris Evans' character fights it. Well, in comes Grandma, and Grandma, of course, comes in all hoity-toity, full of money, and she's like, no, 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 she needs to go to this gifted school. Now, what makes this specific movie so unique are a couple of things. First of all, Chris Evans is such an underrated actor. Now, of course, we all know him from Captain America and those Marvel movies, but if you look at his actual dramatic work, he is a legit actor who's going to have a very, very bright future. Of course, one of the things that we also have to sit back and admire is the fantastic acting of McKenna Grace. This young woman who, by the way, is on the TV show Designated Survivor, is amazing. Honest to God, if this movie had come out later on in the year, I would say that she has a legitimate chance at a Supporting Actress Oscar nomination, and I'm not just stretching it on that. She does a fantastic job for somebody her age. I was absolutely blown away. But one of the things that I think will go might go overlooked with this film is the directing. Mark Webb, who yes, has a perfect name for directing Spider-Man movies, and he should know he's directed two of them, is a fantastic director because this is the same man who directed 500 Days of Summer. In my opinion, one of the best romantic movies of all time. Anyways, I'm not reviewing 500 Days of Summer, I'm reviewing Gifted. And I have to tell you, I was so surprised at how much I enjoyed this film. The writing is genius. I was laughing my way through this film. And then there's also parts, of course, that are very touching and very tender. And I, I thought those blended in very well with the movie as well. The acting is second to none. This is a very entertaining film, and I strongly recommend you check it out. I give this movie a B plus. It's a very, very solid movie and a lot better than I thought it was going to be. I thought, okay, here we go, after school special time, but no, not at all. Great, great film and congrats to Mark Webb on another great hit. Um, I hope you have a chance to see this movie and if you do see Gifted, I would love to know what you think. Reach out to me on Twitter at CFL underscore fan or you can also reach out to me on my Facebook page at facebook.com slash witty wittier as well as witty wittier.com. Thank you so much for checking this out. My name is Keith, and I'll see you at the movies.